Aduh ada Akmal pula. Ya apa? Ya Assalamualaikum and hi. Today our group will present about high rack welding at welding work. Before we go further, let me introduce our group member first. Uh, first, Muhammad Syafudin bin Asli, uh, Muhammad Akmal Daniel bin Muhammad Saiful Nizam, Muhammad Alif bin Ghazali, Hussein Omar Abdullah and Lee Siu Sheng. Next, today we will discuss about introduction of welding, objective, methodology, analysis and discussion, recommendation and conclusion about our project. For introduction, by utilizing intense heat to meet the component together and then allowing them to cool, which a result is fuses welding is a fabrication method that you need you need material typically metal or thermoplastic three three crucial components are needed to make a wheel a heat source such as a flame and electric arc pressure or friction is required before any other material may be joined together to the form a wheel So this is our group objective. First, invest, investigating the, the safety and healthy risk of welding oper, operations and taking corrective action to stop further incidents. Were the goal of this hazard, identification, risk assessment, and risk control high rate project. Next, how to uh, enhance and avoid risk management in the future. And last but not least, the rising staff moral and changing their perspective on safety and healthy while demonstrating a commitment to effective safety and health. Go to the methodology. The methods of hazard. First is review our documentations. Second is inspection and observation observation and lastly measurement next slide and the hazard analysis first is job safety analysis or gsa second is hazard and operability studies or hazard and lastly is port poultry analysis and the four and for the risk assessment is techniques of risk assessment. There is three. First of all is qualitative risk assessment. Second is semi-quantitative risk assessment. And lastly, quantitative risk assessment. And for the risk control is, first of all, theory of control. Second is elimination. Third is substitution, fourth is engineering controls, fifth is administrative controls, and lastly, personal protective equipment or PPE. Okay, then now I will present the analysis and discussion. First of all, analysis and discussion divide into three parts, which is hazard identification, risk analysis, and risk control. For hazard identification, we have work activity, hazard, and which can cause or effect. For risk analysis, we have existing risk control, like likelihood, severity, and risk. Risk control have recommend, recommended control measure. Okay, first of the hazard is exposure to fumes and gases. The hazard is that no minimum safety, safe exposure limit, in adequate ventilation, which can cause to effect the this hazard is pneumonia, asthma, cancer, and metal film fever. The entity risk control for this hazard is covered on button safe work practice. The likelihood of this hazard is three and the severity is four. For risk, we use the formula, which is likelihood times severity, then we get the top. Recommendation control measure is 
make sure that the workplace has adequate ventilation. Okay, for the second hazard is electric shock. Uh, has it touched two metal object which have voltage between each? <coughs> this uh, this can occur or to getting shock. Uh, for risk analysis, as risk control, safe work practice daily, uh, reuse check and regular maintenance. Uh, the likelihood uh, uh, severity is six. To prevent this, uh, you must wear wearing the hand glove and while while handling while handling work. For the third hazard is burn. Uh, this can this hazard uh, that spark from the welding tool. It can cause a uh, flash burn. Uh, safe work practice delivery use uh, check and regular maintenance. For the likelihood uh, severity risk is six. The uh, recommendation control measure you can well uh, well. Welders must always wear the appropriate PPE. Number four for a work activity is a fire and explosion. Uh, for the hazard is flammable object near the working area. And the third one, uh, with the, which, which is a cause for effect, is serious or fatal injury and destruction of property. And also for the existing the control is cover on the button safe for workplace and also for the recommendation is to make relay start button. Let me follow to my next. Okay, okay. for the fifth is injuries from in insufficient PPE. The cut we can say is without ear plus or ear muffins. Construction or manufacturing can cause the hazard, and it can cause cuts and punctures. Okay, then it we can say safe work practice, daily pre-use check and regular maintenance. For the recommendation is administrative control should be taken such as supervision and training for the employee. Uh, number six is in a baby machine guarding equipment malfunction for a breakdown. Uh, an answer for efficient and safe of machine equipment for breakdown. Uh, for the recommendation is attempt more cost for work. And also for uh, the risk, uh, the risk control is to make alarm when the machine gun out from the control. For the number seven is work environment. First is unfavorable behavior of the employee, and the second is organization of culture. The cause is lack of recognition, privatization, unhealthy communication, gossiping, and high turnover. We can, to prevent it, we can attempt more cost work for the employee and the recommendation we can to solve this problem is administrative control should be taken, such as supervision and training for the employee. Thank you. All that. As it is the last level of skills and training, this is because lack of skills and training is needed and injuries. So the employee should attend more coursework. Uh, the risk control for this hazard is administrative control should be taken, such as supervision and training.
For the exposure to UV and ion radiation, uh, the hazard is without the proper protective equipment PPE welding welding certain for the uh, effects of course are art eyes, a painful and occasional chronic condition. For the existing risk control is a few more practice daily pre use check and regular maintenance. For likelihood two, severity three and risk six. So recommendation control measure is wearing the suitable PPE. And last is noise hazard. The hazard is exposed to the loud and continuous noise noise level of more over than 100 db so which can cause or uh, effect is harm the ears and existing risk control or safety work practice daily pre-use a check and regular maintenance like likelihood to uh, severity to and the risk for uh, for the recommendation control measure is where the ear plug Okay, so now I presented the recommendation to improve and to prevent the hazard that occurs in the welding works. First, we have to make sure that adequate ventilation and locker ex house. Second, use a proof respirator read device when ventilation is insufficient. Third, write that there are ACGIH threshold limit values TLB and OSHA permissible. Exposure limits PEL for the substances in welding film. For read the material safety data sheet MSDS for the electrodes facility should be provided. A specialized and additional training must be needed. Nine. Keep dry insulation between themselves and the ground, <coughs> the work and any metal surface or wet surface. 10. Wear dry glove. 11. Check the electrode holder. 12. Always replace or, repair, uh, or, always replace or repair for, uh, faulty insulation before operation. 13. Investigate the surrounding of work environment. 14. And for last, always wear the appropriate PPE. Uh, in conclusion, this analysis has demonstrated how dangerous the welding industry is, but not every welder is aware from every danger for the people nearby the welding area who are not involved in the welding operations. This is even worse in this regard. Some welders and other individuals are impacted by the welding risk, minerally because they are not they are ignorant of such as risk in order to reduce the risk associated with the arc welding. This document offers various safety precautions that should be followed. That's all. Thank you so much. <laughs>